Gary, pre-season games are so often more about the performance than the result, and you must be pleased with what you saw today. Yeah, delighted. I thought it was another really difficult test against a team that were, you know, only one game away from going to the Premier League last season. So delighted with the the, the problems that Coventry gave us, but I thought we were excellent throughout the game. We showed a lot more energy. We showed quality at different moments. After going to go down, we showed a great reaction with a, a younger group of players on the pitch in, in that latter part of the second half and got back into the game. Uh, so delighted with a lot of things and it's another positive step towards obviously the, the start of the season and, and proper football games where there's something at stake next week. Defensively as well, I think we look so much better than we perhaps have in other games this summer. Yeah, much better. I still think there's improvements to be made higher up the pitch and how we go about that pressure. But. Uh, I thought we were aggressive, I thought we were playing on the front foot, we put them under pressure, we asked questions of them. Anytime there was a long ball, we, we closed the space really quickly. Uh, so, delighted for many aspects of the defensive actions that we had, but still areas we can get better at next week. It was a really good battle on the pitch today, I think, between their striker, Matty Godden, and Bill Silasalo. Most of the time, Bill came out on top, and he's going to be tested like that in the league this season. It, it, this was a good warm-up for him, I think. Yeah, I thought he was excellent. He made some good saves, some key saves at, at big moments. I thought he kicked the ball really well. He made good decisions of when to go long and when to play under pressure. Uh, so again, it, he's, it's his third game with the football club. He's still learning about the, the teammates around him and still building those relationships. So he can be really proud of his day's work. I thought some of the build-up build up play, building out from the back was excellent today. We, I think we're really starting to see that style that you want this group of players to play with. Yeah, it's coming. We showed clips at half-time. I thought we could have found the, the number 10s a bit more in the first half and, and second half we tried to do that. Uh, I thought we built a bit more pressure second half with, with some of our deliveries into the box and quality from, from uh, wide areas, uh, but it's, it's still a work in progress. We're really happy with you know, where we've, we've came from in the last few games to today, but it's still a lot, a lot of work next week and, and work right throughout the season to keep improving every single day. One of your summer signings, Vince half with the goal. Don't think he meant it, but not a bad delivery into the box at all, was it, from Vince? And he's had a really impressive pre-season. Yeah, great delivery and, and three players attacking the scoring zone. Uh, Reese Cole coming in behind Noms and uh, Dion Rankin at the back post, ready to try and put it in, should it have not sneaked in the far post. So, you know, delighted with that. Again, it's something we work on, it's something we pride ourselves on and getting people in the scoring zone. And uh, when you do that, you, you get the luck that we got from that goal. Someone who isn't a new signing, but certainly feels like one, Kyle Taylor, 16 months out, came on for a little cameo today and looked impressive. A great moment for Kyle. Yeah, he's been fantastic. I can't speak highly enough of him as a, you know, an individual, what he's went through, how hard he's worked. Pre-season he started extremely well. He picked up another niggly injury in his ankle and, and came back from that quicker than expected. And, you know, fantastic that we could get minutes on the pitch today. And, He's going to be a big player for us this season. He feels like a new signing because I've, I've not had the option to play him since I've been at the club. And great to see him getting the pitch and great to get him to show the, the quality that he has. And we'll try and build up his minutes, build up his, his fitness level so that he's, he's someone that can play a big part this season. Certainly felt like the, the team that started the game today is, is close to what we think you might go with at Wickham next week. But no Harry Kite or Czech Diabate, how are those two? Uh, Harry's picked up a little niggle, a, a muscle injury that hopefully he'll be back training next week at some point. Check yesterday, just late in the session, went off. Uh, we're not 100% sure what it is yet, but we'll assess him early next week. But fingers crossed he should be back at some point next week as well. It does feel like today has been a really positive day in a number of ways. You know, The first pre-season friendly here with a crowd in, in several years and over 5,000 here. It was an excellent atmosphere. Yeah, the crowd's amazing. I think to you know to have a pre-season game here is good, uh, but to get the numbers we had for for that is, uh, shows the supporters again in a fantastic light. Great to see so many Coventry fans as well. Uh, a fantastic football club, a, a club I played for on loan many many years ago. Uh, but a, a great atmosphere, a great competitive game played in the right way for for both teams. I think to to ready themselves for the the start of the season next week. And finally, the third kit launch today went down. It's hugely popular in the club shop. Well, just your thoughts on it? I hope there's some small sizes for my kids because they're they're desperate for their strips. So I'll be trying to get that in the club shop later. But again, I think all the kits have went down really well, uh, and we hope to see many fans wearing them in this stadium all season. So next week, then League One starts. 
Yeah, looking forward to it. I said to the players, we, we've got a family day tomorrow where we'll, we'll be together socially. We're off on Monday and then it's our four day, our normal four day build up into the start of the season where whilst we're happy with what we did, there's still some, some things we need to work on, but we will work on them next week and, and throughout the season to, to be ready every single game to, to give everything to, to win games for this football club. Great stuff, Gary. Thanks a lot. Thank you.